Hey guys, today we're trying Mo Astray, probably M-O Astray, like that's my M-O, my modus operandi. Uh, as requested by Patreon subscriber Calliope Rannis. Reset jump direction set to normal. That's fine. Using the mouse will give you a completely different experience than using a controller. Well... A bit of a claim, isn't it? Ooh. That is a nice looking start screen. How we doing? What resolution we're at? Ah, I see you there. Ooh. It doesn't have a bunch of nonsensical confusing resolutions. It just has... You just skip straight to the ones that everyone usually uses. There we go. I had to hit A to continue it. Kept resetting it. Usually I have to press down like 75 times to get to from 720 to 1080 because there's a lot of strange resolutions along the way. And I guess someone out there must be buying those those monitors, but I don't know who. Oh. All right, that escalates quickly. Normal, easy, normal, adventure, disaster. Are these escalating difficulties? This is hard. For a gamer's experience with action games, then difficult mode for big Well, we're just doing a let's try, so it's just, let's just go. Let's just go chill. Hello, I am Blob. Am I going? Probably supposed to go right. You're usually supposed to go right. But for some reason it felt like going left. Maybe it was the dust particles? Currently no buttons do things. Besides joystick. I'm running out of time. There are obstacles everywhere. I, I call it grass, but okay. Well, those look weird. They're like spider web slash dead leaf trees. This is going to be my toughest run yet. Run. Oh, I'm I'm more bouncy blobby now. I'm now flopping instead of squelching across the map. Are you eating these tree things? Even if it blurs my memories further. What? Right joystick gives me a trajectory line. Left trigger is jump. It, oh. Let's see, it's based on the sensitivity of, of your uh, controller. Well, I think I'm done using- I'm done walking now, I think. I have to make it more stable. More complete. Ooh! You can stick to the walls for a bit. If you stick to a ledge, you can climb it. Sup? All right. The time has come. Come to me. Come to me. Help me. Oh, I thought I was the one doing the tough run, but now the but now the voice sounds like it's from somewhere else. Uh oh. This is your only mission. And it's <laughs> the reason you were born. And it is how you will die. 
Oh. Am I gonna go popping out of that little canister? Sup? Weird blob reporting in. Hey, little guy. You're finally up. You had me waiting for a while. Well, <laughs> that was quick. Already failed. Ah. I thought something went wrong. Fuck. Thank goodness you're okay. Hopefully we won't have much... You'll have to hurry. I don't know what they said. Uh, yes, the quicker the better. Things are getting way too messy up here. I'm sick of this place. Yeah. All right, getting around. Watch out! Oh, those creepy-looking purple plants are everywhere. Do not, you do not want to touch those things. Uh, yeah. There we go. Ah, uh, so it just loops around. Oh, I missed. There we go. Secret? Maybe? Really? Mantis Corporation's really gonna hire me? They're gonna give a fledgling scientist like me a chance? Finally, I'm one step closer to my dream. I better not let this pass me by. I hope that one day I'll be able to make this world a better place. I'm guessing those that were already like post apocalypse -y. Like these are old memories of dead people. Is there a hole up here? I don't think so. Sheep. This is a different way of getting around. Wow, little guy. You're a lot more nimble than I thought you'd be. I did it. Oh. That is not how I thought that would work. This is a little challenging. Careful. Ooh, he likes to, he likes to fall off things. Ah, risky business. Ah, ah. I think part of it is I keep expecting uh, an equal in all directions jumping arc. Like it'll be a nice even U shape. But. I have, a, yeah, I have a forward momentum at the beginning of the jump, and then I pretty much fall straight down after that part. I have to be ready for a big, very abrupt fall. Uh-oh. Cordyceps fungus claims another universe. Uh... Do you eat blobs? Ow! Oh, how could you possibly be this mean to the blob from Bastion? So excited. This is the greatest moment of my life. This conference is the result of years of my research. What? This... Wait. What is all this about? My research isn't meant to be used on weapons technology. No. Is it me? Am I the weapons technology? Ah! Fuck. There we go. <laughs> These people, they've been like this ever since I woke up. They aren't as bad as the monsters up here. But it's best we keep our distance. Well, yeah, they're like some sort of horrible monster blobs. They've been fungused. Uh oh. Ah!
Does he fall off of ceilings? Ah, go, go, go. Or just walls? Uh. Bye bye. I'm out. Deuces. Oh, that was there. Rude. Why was I programmed to have fear? Ew, that was a close one. At least we have time to something something elevator. Timing based dialogue playing automatically while I'm playing the game, but not voiced is not my favorite feature. You're gonna have dialogue play while I'm playing the game without being press A to continue. I'd prefer it to be voiced, at least. Otherwise, it's kind of awkward. I'm just gonna miss it when I'm trying to do these platforming challenges, which you already set up. Like, I'll fall if I don't react in time sometimes. And they talk a lot, actually. Let's see. There we go. I was having trouble hitting these. There we go. I thought there'd be another path. Did you go and hide something over here? That seems obstructed. Fuck. <laughs> it's not what I was going for. Is that an impossible jump? Looks like it. It looks doable, but it's not. Uh oh. There we go. Definitely a game that'll take some practice. It's very, it's very much its own particular movement system. There we go. I got somewhere. System detecting number. Oh. That's the Eye of C'Thun. Here it comes. Seen this place before, little guy. A nasty place for experiments. It's dirty and smelly. God damn it. Jumping hard. Ah, I see the problem here. You straight up can't continue in this direction without the platform over here. I was wondering what it was for, because it seemed easy to, enough to get across the gap. There we go. I think I'm in danger. Bye. Just gonna go down the poop hole now. Goodbye forever, I'm not coming back. What is happening? So this is like my personal growth dimension or something? Like it's like not, this isn't a physical location, I guess. Which is probably why these look like some kind of like nervous systems. Oh, I'm gonna attach myself to zombies now. You can latch, latch onto monsters' heads. When you latch onto their head, you can control the monster's movements. You can also read information in their brains by holding A. Ah. Well, cool, I'm a brain parasite monster creature. I'm just as bad as the fungus. Useless. Probably because you're not real. Anyway, bye. Hit. 
Ow. No, I'm all the way back here. I know. I did it already. Jesus, didn't realize we were playing that way in the tutorial area. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, this uh, this movement scheme was probably gonna wear thin on me <laughs> if I were to play it for an extended period of time. I think I'm gonna get frustrated. <laughs> Just go over the corner, it's right there! Oh my fucking god! Why is this so hard? I did it the first try, and I don't know how I did it, so now I can't recreate it, apparently. <laughs> nail it. There we go. I guess it's just like a little too pixel perfect with its height. So you have to get just the right jump arc or you're fucked. Whee! Oh, that looks like a bad hole. Do I need to like... Uh Please land on his head! Oh my god. I feel like I figure I probably have to walk him in the hole. There we go. Let's try this again. You have any brain stuff in you? He's garbage. Cool. Alright. Here we go. That's what I figured. Uh, am I gonna take over a corpse? We're getting some inside territory where things are getting creepy. They already kind of were. Stop. The only word I could read was stop. Um. What's going on? Are you okay, little guy? Your body is changing. I've never seen anything like it. Just, what is this machine? How did they do this to you? I've got like a little zombie mouth. <laughs> anyway, bye. Are those symbols on my head new? I don't think they are. Oh. Oh, that's a lot of, that's a lot of distressing spike stuff. This tower, those devices, as for... Alright. I have no idea. I, I'm gonna give up on the dialogue. I'm sorry, but it's just... It never shuts up, and I'm playing a game? So, I'm just not gonna read it, because it's it keeps going. And I can't... This game... this the, the, the gameplay takes too much of my mind up for me to be ignoring it and multitasking that hard. What are you... Ooh, can I trick you into standing in the section that controls the movement? Oh, he chases me. No, get get down! Ah! I couldn't get off in time. No. Nope. Hey, buddy. How you doing? Okay, now, quickly, quickly, quickly. I don't think I fall down. Yeah, I only I think I only fall by sliding down walls, but I don't fall off of things unless I press it down. Something fishy's going on here. Uh, shitty or angry or me? Yep. Oh, it's kind of like a flea, isn't it? Okay, so it has spikes, but they're not that tall. They're not that long. Hey, buddy. Ah, shit! 
Can I brain control you? Yes. Okay. I was wondering how I was going to get anywhere. Uh-oh. Fuck. Yeah, you can't- you cannot climb a wall. The game has a pretty strong control over your ability to get around. You cannot climb any walls in slime mode. Uh, unless it's like a situation where there's two walls facing each other that are completely safe. If either wall is kind of dangerous, you're fucked. Ah, fuck. Up we go. It's like he's got creepy little hands. We just gotta be very patient. It's funny I mentioned the cordyceps fungus because it seems like we are practically that in a way. At the moment. Hey buddy, would you like to come over here and use this button for some reason? It's a good thing the zombie doesn't like falling off cliffs. It has that much- it has that much mind left, at least. Um... I think I need to mind control you? You won't use it yourself. Oh, yeah, you have to hold it for a while, too. Yeah, so just sending him over there wasn't enough. Oh, fuck, is it about, is it about to drop it? Hey, what's that? Oh, it's... It makes new ones? It makes a new human that's pre-infected or something? Why would it do that? Oh, that's creepy looking. I don't like that. Do you have thoughts? Let me go! You rat. Quit squirming. What else do you want from us? No, no! I'm not going in there! Spoilers, they went in there. Let me out! This seems ethical. There's only one left. Yeah, let's get it over with. I've had enough of this. You bastards, untie me now! What's this smoke? What? What is this? Get these off me! Get them off now! I guess those masks aren't very helpful. Uh-oh. Everyone's dying. Well. Glad we witnessed that, huh? So are you the person that we just saw there? Oh god, I didn't even see what I was jumping into. Hey, buddy. Ow. Oh. That one's green. Oops. Didn't, I did not want to turn that corner. Hello, gross one. How do you do? Fuck. Why is this deceptively hard? Okay. There we go. Everything's getting distressing. Fuck! Jesus, stop! Unnecessary. Unnecessarily large death hitbox. Jesus. Alright. Hey, buddy. No! I wasn't pressing it anymore! I had, com I had completely stopped pressing left. So that's... Uh. Fuck! They want to die? <laughs> Alright. So ledges in this game have no stickiness. 
or too much stickiness. I'm actually not sure what the best way of putting it is, I guess. But your character loves to just go careening off cliffs even after you stop pressing a direction. And then it also includes turning corners into spikes. So I just gotta stop well beforehand or my characters will just kill themselves. Hit! Oh god, there we go. I'm free! Oh, we're back at the snake that was set up earlier. Is it gonna get me? Are we moving on? Goodbye, monster from Subnautica or something. Sup? That looks safe. Whee! Didn't work out. Didn't work out. Button? Oh. That's not what I thought was going to happen at all. Wow, I nailed that on my first try, basically, like on accident. Shit. I happened to press the button at the exact moment where I found out... Not only did I find out what it did, but it happened to land exactly where I needed it to. That was some luck. button control at this distance. No! Why do you do little hops off of things? Jesus. That, that, that frustrates me a bit. It's like, my character wants to die. I was slightly unhappy with the spacing, so I decided to move the middle one, too. Beep. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh. oh boy. Alright, well this room's gonna wear its welcome out, ain't it? Can I just get up there? Oh. Mm, yeah, they, they it's like designed in a lab to make sure that you can't reach the ceiling here. Yep, it's like the exact height to stop you. Fuck. No, oh, I'm not on the wall, shit. Or I am on the wall. I don't know if I'll get past this room if I'm being honest. I don't have the most faith. Fuck, I missed. I'm trying to watch the right side of the screen. Because I have... I have to get all of three of these in the, just the right distance that I can jump them, and I don't have that much of a memorized feel for my jump arc, necessarily. This might be a bit of a tall order. That's not good. Alright. Let's give this one more try. Ha! Ah, sliding. Come on. Huh? Yeah! Oh. Goober. I will now suck your brain out. What? What did they say? They want to make another one. That's suicide. That thing. It's not something we humans can control. He's my age. And dead. How could you do this? This isn't what we agreed on. Spare me that nonsense. What a ridiculous excuse. I'm leaving, Mantis. That's right, I'm leaving. There we go. We overcame that particular thing. Oh, so I guess these are heart pieces. So if you get five of those, you get an extra health thing, I think, because it looks like the ones in the top corner. Didn't, reckon, didn't really register that until just now, necessarily. This is a decent little intro, so if, you look, if you've liked what you've seen, you can check out this game via the link in the description. Thank you to the developers for sending me a code so I could preview their game. Thanks for watching like always, guys, and I'll see you next time.